today we talk about <laughs> yo uh we gotta talk but first what are those hey yo well first and foremost uh they do fit a ma or fit <laughs> that's the main issue uh they look fire on feet i mean all these little details on the shoe the little mesh pad the lovely blah 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 blah, blah. the lovely uh, translucency of the sole a lack of whiteness still making it look dope, but it's all uh, pretty, pretty, pretty nice. But I have a couple qualms, which we'll get into. So there you go. The fire, the fit is fire in terms of a uh, style, but in terms of actual fit, bleh. So in honor of Air Max month, I decided to rock these, but here's the issue. I wore them all day yesterday and right now they feel okay, but even putting them on was kind of wacky because you slip into them and they feel tight up in here but they were dumb loose back in here like i could easily slip out of them and i still can kind of and so i had to actually tighten this like a bitch uh to be able to keep it from uh, sliding out too easily and this is true to size by the way um and uh i spent all day in these going around the city Bop. and uh you know after towards the end of the day especially this part right here was killing me dog uh, it was a problem. Ooh, mini swoosh, what'd it do? Um, so that's, that's my one qualm with this. I don't know that there's a good fix for this ish. Um, but sometimes they say you gotta mix pain with pleasure. So what do you, what do you, what you gonna do? <laughs> Got him. But yeah, man, that's all there will be to it. Otherwise, historic shoe, uh, most Air Max, biggest Air Max bubble yet. Uh, second lifestyle model only Air Max model after the 270 that dropped uh, last year. And um, yeah, it's uh, pretty, pretty good. But yeah, I don't know that it's gonna be a daily wear for me, that's for sure. Uh, but with that said, we'll see you on the next one. We out. Bye.